Ted. We're back with the 55 grapple. As you know, when we started changing the DOM tubing because we couldn't get it through here, we started putting the hard ox rail on it. And it's got a slot for every time. And in one way, it made it five times stronger. In another way, we, we were putting so many gussets to keep this end pieces from bending. Um, we didn't put the gussets on it after we quit using the DOM. We thought that maybe the solidness through there would keep it keep them from bending. We've got about 30 or 40 of them in the field and we've had two bent. Both of them were doing the same thing. They were pushing over trees and logging. And logging is, you know, so I don't feel like anybody's gonna have problems. If anybody would like, we do have these new gussets where, so to put on here, so it'll look like the bottom and it'll brace it out. It's a wicked gusset. So this is the way we're gonna start making them for a permanent uh, fix. Um, so we would send these out to anybody that wanted them, they got one without them. But the worst thing, this is about a nine inch spacing. And the worst thing is a tree, anything to do with logging, to where the, they hit right here and they wanna, they're, they're trying to just use it like a wedge, just like you drive it in a tree to split it for a split post fence. Um, I think with these on it, no matter what, it'll stand the power for each grapple it should have. Uh, we've never really had any problem here before because um, we had all those gussets on there. My goodness, there were gussets top, bottom, everywhere. The whole lid was gusseted. And, and we think we're, we're, we're better than we were. And these actually are, are more wicked, look better, and they're gonna give you more wear area. And we think it'll keep them from splitting. So we're not really gonna try to take this tree out. It's a nice pecan tree. We're gonna beat it up a little bit. But we're just gonna do a little jamming on here. And we're not really trying to push it. We're gonna do it with the lid instead of the bottom because the lid's the only place we're having a problem. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna find the place where they kind of fit the easiest to make them bend and make sure that it'll take the full horsepower of the 60 horsepower to go on this grapple without being
we made a little mess over here for Eddie to clean up. That's where it's in there. Um, that wasn't exactly what I was expecting. I wasn't expecting that tree to push over as easy as it did. Uh, but I rammed it a few times on some places. I don't think you're gonna be in this. That's a total of, um, what, three quarters there mm -hmm. now with the laminated pines. Uh, I believe it's good to go. This is our final, final. I hope, please, thank you, God. Um, so this is the way they'll start coming out here today. Uh, if you haven't gotten the shipping notice, likely yours is gonna come out like this. What well, lucky guy get that one? One lucky guy gets this one. I'll sign it for you.